if I put ice in a glass of water, wait for the ice to melt, and mark the level. Can you guess if the water level will go up, down, or stay the same? If you don't know the answer, that's okay. You can just pause the video and try to figure it out. Oh, you're back. Well, the ice had time to melt while you were gone. Let's check it out. I think the ice is gone. If you guess the water level would be the same. You were correct. If you weren't correct, that's alright, you'll figure out why. Here's why. The ice floats because solid ice is less dense than liquid water, so for the same volume it is actually lighter. There are two forces acting on the ice. The weight of the ice pushes it down, and Archimedes' principle tells us the pressure of water is an upward force equal to the weight of water that is displayed by ice. Since the ice is lighter, you need to move a smaller volume of water than the volume of ice. In other words, when the two forces are equal, some of the ice sticks above the water. But wait, if the weight of the ice is the same as the weight of the water it displaces, and since when it melts, the ice keeps its weight, then that means that once it's changed back into water, its volume is exactly what is needed to fill the hole it was making in the water when it was solid. This is why the level of the water doesn't change when the ice melts. Ooh, does this mean that as the earth gets warmer and the ice melts, the level of the oceans is not going to change like some Republicans like to claim? Well, yes, it does. Republicans are right. Well, almost. That would only be true if all the ice was already floating in the oceans, such as the ice cap at the North Pole. Antarctica, Greenland, and glaciers all around the Earth are different, however. They are covered with ice that is on solid ground, not water. If it melted, it would absolutely raise the level of the sea. By 70 meters, that's 230 feet for non-metric people. Here's a sample of what this would look like. Credits to floodmap.net. For example, this is where Florida would be. I hope this video helps you understand why a warmer earth means higher sea levels, but not because of melting sea ice.